We're back once again looking at an entry into the gift wrap and a finishing position that involves us sitting our partner up so that we can take the back rather than pulling them onto us as we saw in a previous video. So we're going to look at what happens when our partner is down the bottom of the cross side position. As we've seen, we use our hips to block our partner's legs and walk so that we can sit our body through slightly. If you get underneath your partner's arm on this side, that's great. We're going to find our partner's wrist. We come back, we get a grip on the wrist, and we drive to put the wrist down towards the floor. It's unrealistic to think, in most cases, that you're going to finish somebody from here, but you will be able to prompt them turning into you, and that's what we're looking for. We're going to put that knee down, sweep the arm back behind the head, and cover their arm, their tricep, with our chest here. Okay, this chest to tricep position is essential if you want to keep the elbow in front. Now you can get your grip here, one and two. Previously, we saw that we sat in behind our partner, but sometimes you don't have the confidence to windshield wipe with this leg and sit. Maybe you've done it before and your partner has hipped out away from you and sucked this elbow to the inside. You could move your hips out this way and bring your elbow through. You lose the grip in this case. If we're worried about that, then we're going to forego sitting our partner back in this fashion and we're going to sit them up. We're going to take our elbow and lift to get our partner seated here so we can put our chest on our partner's back. Toes go to the floor and we hop up. Now we're going to place our near leg in first one. We're going to tilt to the side two and now our second hook goes in place here three. You're clear to bring the wrist up above the line of the shoulder and head in for your strangles. So from the reverse angle, let's look at the reverse angle here. So. So we're here, your partner's got the arm in place, you're going to sit your body through, retract, come through, and you're going to put your partner's wrist down towards the floor. You're going to walk up, sweep the arm back, lock the figure of four. Previously we saw that we could, you know, previous video that is, we could sit back and throw the leg over. From here we're going to simply sit our partner up. You're going to take your elbow, drive it forward here in this fashion. Now you're going to pop up. You're going to place the top leg in, so that's the leg away from the side that you're gripping. You're going to go in like so. Now we're going to tilt down, pass the second foot in place here, and you're ready to go on your strangles. When you're working from the gift wrap position, you have tremendous control of your partner's upper body. Most of it has to do with your chest to your partner's tricep to stay outside the line of their arm in order to also drive their elbow across their center line. From there, you can lock the figure of four, and you have the ability to take them from one side to the other. If you can, you can sit right back down and fall to the back. If not, you can sit them up and throw the hook in. Hopefully this was helpful. If you enjoyed it, let us know. See you soon.